G'day, I'm Neen James and welcome back to Amaze TV. Thanks for subscribing to this channel and especially a huge thanks to those of you who have been sharing this with your friends and writing comments. We appreciate it and I promise I love reading all of them. Today in Amaze TV, we're going to talk about this whole idea about how do you have more impact and influence in the world. And for those of you who've been following along, you know that I believe to truly be amazing, meaning a H amazing means to wake up every day in awe and wonder and anticipate what's going to happen. I believe that when it comes to being amazing, that one of the key components is to be able to conquer the world. But that's your world. It could be something that you need to conquer at work. It might be something you need to conquer at home or maybe something in your community. There's three strategies I believe are vital if you really want to conquer the world that you're in. And that is number one, do it. And I know the Nike slogan is way overused and yet there is a simplicity to that. I think that we procrastinate for so many different reasons, and procrastination is not such a bad thing. One of my favorite books uh, is Procrastinate on Purpose by Rory Vaden, and he talks about procrastination and why it happens. But I think that we don't do things, we put them off because we think they'll take too long, or we don't know where to start, or maybe we don't like the person who gave it to us. But the reality is, in order to conquer the world, you've got to do it. You've got to decide commit and implement. So my first suggestion to you is whatever you've been putting off, decide whether it really is going to be something worth your time and attention and then commit to getting it done. So the first strategy, I hate to tell you, it's pretty simple. You just need to do it. The second strategy in conquering the world is truly to get systemized. Now systems create freedom. We all have systems in our life. Maybe you just don't call it that. One of the systems that I use is every day I write a little post-it note and it's my three not negotiable activities I'm going to do to conquer my world today. Just three. I spend 15 minutes every day deciding what are my three not negotiables, meaning before my head hits the pillow tonight, what do I need to get done? So every day I write, today I will, and then I write down my three. I love crossing them off. So what you need to do is decide on what's your system. Now, a couple of my favorite systems. On a Sunday, I will have a cross, I will, <laughs> sorry, I will have a look across my week and I will decide where do I need to be, who do I need to see, and when I'm home, I will put all my outfits out for the week. I know that sounds really crazy, but when I'm traveling, I'll just pack them in my bag. But the beauty of a Sunday plan is that my week is more productive because I don't have to think about what am I going to wear each day and stand in front of my closet and say, oh my God, I have nothing to wear. Now that tip is courtesy of Megan Christelle from Christelle Closets and she encourages people to do that as well. Systems could include the way you drive home every day. You may not call it a system, but chances are you go the same way home every day. It means you don't have to think as much about it. You see, systems create freedom. I've even systemized connecting with people that I really care about. I was given a phenomenal, gorgeous wall calendar, and normally I don't really keep them, but Jason Kotecki is a friend and a brilliant artist, and he gave me a great calendar this year. And so what I did was I sat down at the beginning of the year and I wrote a note on all working days to connect with someone, to reach out to a friend, a client, an old friend, to send a note, send a text, to send a gift, whatever it is. I probably shouldn't be telling you that, but that's one of my secrets. I have systemized being thoughtful. Does that make sense to you? We need systems in place because in the busyness of our everyday, it's really easy to forget how to conquer our world. And I believe in making people feel like they matter because they do. And sometimes we need a system to remind us. I mean, how do you remember birthdays? Well, nowadays, Facebook tells you that's a system. Find your system. The third strategy is one you've heard me say many, many times, and that is invest 15 minutes. I know it sounds crazy, but you would be astounded at what you can get done in just 15 minutes. You can get healthy in 15 minutes a day. You can meditate. You could go to sleep earlier. You could wake up earlier. You could work out. You could go for a walk around the block. You could cut up some veggies and put them in little baggies. I do that. And then I've got them ready to go for my snacks for the week. You might be able to call a friend. If your mum is still on this planet, call your mum. If you are fortunate to still have someone on this planet that you love dearly, maybe you just need to invest 15 minutes.
Call your mum or call your dad or call someone who has had an impact in your life. See, conquering the world is about doing it and it's about getting systemized and it's about thinking in time in just 15 minute increments. That's the key. Because we all want to be more amazing every day. And that means having more impact and influence in our little world, whether it's at home, at work, in the community, or maybe even on the planet. So how can I help you? What did you like about this video? I would love to hear what you're going to do. Just do it. What are you going to systemize and what are you going to spend 15 minutes on? So write your comments down below. Remember, I read them and I love getting them. It's kind of like I get more connected when you write these comments and I kind of hear what you like and maybe what you don't. So what I'd love to do is stay connected with you. And there's a couple ways we can do that. You can follow me on Twitter. My Twitter handle is at Neen James. You can come across to Facebook and like us at Neen James Communications. And of course, you can find more on our website, NeenJames.com. Remember today, oh, that was my cat. Remember today that you can truly be amazing.